So, hi, I don't actually know. I think the live stream's up there. Um, everyone in the audience here, if you weren't aware, we're also live streaming this. Um, so, everybody here in the audience and everybody at, out at home, if you could take your phones out and instead of putting them on airplane mode, open up Twitter <laughs> and find at Nuclear Bootcamp, that's us. We'd love to hear from you during the presentations. Um, you think I'm kidding, but I'm not. Um, anyway, we're here at the uh, closing ceremonies for the second annual Nuclear Innovation Boot Camp. Um, my name is Kathy Shields, and I will be emceeing today. Um, I'm really excited to get started, um, and I'm just going to kick us off right away with some introductory remarks from electrical engineering and computer science professor Sujay King Lin. All right, thank you. All right, good afternoon and welcome everyone to the College of Engineering and to the nuclear engineering, the second um, annual nuclear engineering boot camp. I'd firstly like to start off by uh, expressing deepest appreciation to Professor Rachel Slabo and to Kathy and the rest of the organizers, um, as well as to the mentors, experts, and additional volunteers who've made this event possible. Thank you very much for your hard work. Um, so it's really nice to see so many people here who care about clean energy and a sustainable environment, um, and maybe nuclear and science and engineering as well. Um, your active participation in this remarkable. I'm not here anything. <laughs> okay, that's not okay. I can start all over. You can keep going. So that's our, our, that, that's that's uh, I assume it's Professor. You're good now. Okay, Professor Sachs, can you hear us now? I can. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, welcome. I'm I'm uh, Sujay Liu. I'm uh, an engineering faculty member here and also vice provost for the Ac uh, of academic and space planning here. So I'm just going to set the context for your remarks um, in just a couple of minutes. Um, so I think we all know that the Bay Area is renowned for its entrepreneurial um, culture, and so it's fitting that this boot camp was initiated here at Berkeley. Um, how many of you actually know that Berkeley? Uh, over the last 10 years, has started, uh, Berkeley graduates have started the most companies of any university in the world. Woo! Did you know that? No. Yeah. Um, well, there's this other university uh, in the Bay Area that's also known for starting a lot of companies. But it turns out that our graduates have started more. Um, <laughs> but, but to be fair, OK, they, they, they've raised more money on the other side of the Bay. But that just shows that we're more uh, efficient, right? <laughs> <laughs> Right, we, we can do more with less money. So today here at Berkeley, um, I hope you also know that we have a lot of programs that are um, designed to train new entrepreneurs and also to support or to incubate new startup companies. Um, so, and ultimately, we are doing this because we know it's a good way to accelerate the adoption of innovations uh, to, to really benefit our uh, global society. Um, you actually might be surprised to learn that there are, today there are more than 50 startup companies in nuclear energy uh, throughout North America only. And today you'll hear pitches, I think, from uh, five or six teams uh, in, this, in this space. Um, so under the theme of Tomorrow Today, each team has envisioned a new startup that solves a pressing issue in some innovative way um, with potentially uh, revolutionary impact. So I hope that you're all excited to, as much as I am, to hear from these team, 